This exhibition spans 15 years of my career. There's pieces in here from the very beginning when I started to create Fashions from Trash all the way to my last exhibition in the Atlanta airport. I've used materials ranging from old rusty nails to pieces of glass to leather seat covers from airplanes and plastic bags to laundry detergent um, bottles. There's all kinds of materials that I have gathered over the years from doing actually a lot of dumpster diving. I also go through my neighbor's recycling bins all the time and I'm asking my friends for materials or in some cases like with my commissioned pieces like from Delta Airlines or Toyota they sent me materials from their trash and recycling bins. For me I really love creating pieces with the community in particular and I have two pieces in the exhibit that I've made with in one case 5,000 people. The Eco Flamenco was made um, during a three-week workshop in Grand Rapids, Michigan and 5,000 people participated by writing eco pledges on the little circles that are uh, were turned into ruffles on the dress. So I really hope as you walk around and um, enjoy the exhibit that you are intrigued by, you know, I always hope from afar it looks like a beautiful, sleek, elegant fashion and then when you get up close you'll say, hey, wow, that's made from glass or aluminum or how, how was that done? So for me as an artist, I really love the uh, challenge of taking trash, something that we think of as dirty or ugly, smelly, that we want to get away from us and then transforming it into something that it's elegant or glamorous. That is what really excites me uh, as an artist, as well as, of course, uh, the environmental messages that then I'm able to weave in to those themes. So I hope that you enjoy um, the visuals as well as the concept as you explore the exhibit.